But yeah. when you face a quarterback like Patrick every day in practice and through training camp, does that help you to prepare a guy with a big arm, even though he, you know, runs a lot too? Well, uh, definitely. Uh, uh, Pat definitely tests us deep, you know, all throughout practice, training camp, and things like that. And, you know, Lamar, he can definitely do the same thing. So just being able to have that in practice, get those type of plays and things like that would definitely help. You're coming from a hostile environment where, the, you know, the defense certainly heard the crowd. Now you got the home crowd behind mm -hmm. you. How excited are you to play at home? Uh, it's definitely going to be fun. You know, they're definitely going to be ready, home opener and things like that. So it's definitely going to be a lot of good energy in the stadium. How difficult does a guy like Lamar make it to set the edge when, when you know that's going to be so important to win this game? Uh, I mean, his speed, his quickness, it definitely threatens it. You know, you just got to be um, sound defensively. You know, everybody just just do your job. Everybody take care of what they have to do. And just it's going to take all 11 guys working together as, as one. What, what changed in the locker room or, or amongst the team last week when you go from giving up points in the first two possessions to kind of flipping the switch and, and, and having success after that? Uh, I mean, I think that's that's just part of football. You know, you go into uh, you go into a team's stadium, you know, with a with a big fan. You, you're gonna face some adversity. It's just that's just part of the game. You charge into the game. Everybody stayed even kill. Everybody just talked it over on the sidelines, and we just kept on doing what we were doing. So, really, in in Spags, you know, he said early on, he said we're gonna have to face something, something that's gonna something big that's gonna happen in the game early on that we just gotta face it and uh, you know just get better from it. Do you have an identity this defense yet? If, if if you could kind of put a name to it, what is the identity of this defense? Uh, well, it's hard. We only played two games, but give us a couple more games and we'll we'll be able to have some. So some in two it. weeks, I could come over here. I mean, because you've been through training camp together, mm -hmm. you've evolved together, you're getting closer together. You don't have a feel for what it might be. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, you we we all talk about it now. Just there's some things that that you don't learn until Sundays. So. Being able to experience Sundays together, certain situations that you may not have got in practice that you see in the game, you learn from each other, talking to each other, being able to go through weeks like this during the season for each other. So it's still, you know, a lot, a lot for us to learn together. You know, there was a, I think Andy said last year that Tremont was the guy that was used to sort of simulate Lamar's speed and what he could do in the backfield. Is there anything going on like that this year, or is there's last year enough experience to sort of know what to expect? Uh. I mean, anytime you watch film, you know what to expect out of it. Um, but uh, I think they got somebody in mind. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to see him today, but we'll see. <laughs> any, All any? good, guys? All good?